So Samsung is also very big with gaming. They have gaming monitors, they have cool features for uh, gaming TVs, and they also have phones that are very capable. So let's take a closer look what they have this year in their gaming section. So they have this phone, so I'm assuming these are the yes, S23 Ultra connected to a TV. So you can do some gaming with your phone. I'm assuming this is already available. I haven't tried this, but if you guys have, let me know in the comments below. How is this experience? But as soon as I get home, I am going to try this myself. In this section, you're actually able to sit down and play some games with the Samsung S23 Ultra. There's some people who are already gaming here. It looks a lot of fun. I have this phone and I actually never used it for gaming. I should, right? Do you guys game a lot on phones? I should start doing that. It looks like a lot of fun. I mean, this phone looks amazing. Look at that. Samsung is promoting a lot of gaming with this phone. Over here, they have a new 3D gaming monitor. That is crazy. I've been thinking about something like this. Remember when 3D TVs came out and there were some games that had 3D options too? Well, this is coming back again, but without glasses. So this is uh, just an example how this works. You guys are not going to be able to see the 3D effect. You have to be sitting in front of the monitor for it to take over. But uh, I'm very impressed how 3D is coming back again, but without the glasses. This is something that I we all be thinking about, or at least dreaming about, but it is becoming a reality now. Guys, there's a lot of new gaming monitors coming this year, and of course, you're going to need high-performance HDMI cable. I've been using Rui Pro cables when testing TVs, monitors, and projectors, and I highly recommend this brand. And recently, they released their thinnest high-performance HDMI 2.1 cable, which is more flexible, and it's ultra-certified for high-speed data transfer. So if you're looking for a reliable HDMI cable for your home theater, or gaming setup, check out Rui Pro Cables. There's going to be a link in the description of the video. Oh my God, and we have the Odyssey OLED monitors in the house, guys. The 32 inch flat 4K, 240 Hertz OLED monitor from Samsung is here and it's looking gorgeous. From what I heard, this monitor, it has a matte finish display, but seeing it in person, it looks Beautiful, I like it. As far as I know, this is QD OLED, so yes, colors look impressive. Viewing angles are also fantastic, and it's also fast responsive. That is uh, some of the features from OLED. Are you guys into the OLED set of monitors? Let me know in the comments below which one is your favorite so far. There's so many options coming out right now, but and I'm a big fan of Samsung, so I'll probably pick this one up. So this is the Odyssey OLED G8. Right next to it, we also have the G6 model, which is a smaller version of the OLED, but this is 1440p. And I think this is 360 hertz of refresh rate. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't have any information here. There's nothing here, but I'm just be able to look at these monitors it looks amazing this is also flat so if you guys don't like curved monitors these models are going to be probably the best option for you and this is the g9 folded as well there's also another version that came out a few months ago but this is the newest version look at this humongous monitor i think this is like a 49 inch or 50 inch it's huge I don't have the space for something like this, unfortunately, so I won't be picking this up, but it is looking impressive with this aspect ratio. Oh my God. Look at that for racing. Such an immersive experience. Immersive experience. Oh my God. I would love to try something like this. Racing gaming chair, Ricardo with the uh, Samsung curved monitor. Oh my God. 
So yes guys, these are the monitors from Samsung. I'm so excited for to finally have an OLED 32 inch 4K monitor. I'm going to get this most likely because I want to compare it to the mini LED Neo G8 that I do have at home. So if you want to see that comparison, stay tuned for more videos. I don't know about you guys, but I'm super excited for those new monitors from Samsung. Look impressive, especially that new G8 OLED. I want to get my hands on that. Let me know in the comments below if you guys are also excited for this new OLED 32 inch 4K monitors. Stay tuned for more from CES 2024. I'm Joster and I'll see you guys. Joster!